everyone. This is Ben Kasdan, live from John Wayne Airport, where I spend most of my time with Jan. Um, so it's a real uh, pleasure to help install her as a California Council President. Um, Jan has made a big impact in my life and lots of other people's lives. And um, I just want to tell a little anecdote. She and her husband, William, were a year ahead of me um, and my wife at Cal Poly San Luis Obispo. And um, when I was in fifth year, um, Jenna came back to Cal Poly to a job fair and convinced me and my then fiance at the time to practice interview with KTGY. It'd be a good experience. And uh, we weren't really planning on coming back to Orange County. And um, she really just encouraged us to like have that experience of practice interviewing. And um, I've been at KTGY ever since. So that's a really big impact on my life. Um, I've been at KTGY for 13 years now. And that's, it's been great. And um, when it comes to what I um, am excited about um, for her upcoming presidency, um, I just like the way she approaches um, solutions. She just will answer common problems in a new way. And she inspires that creativity in everyone. And I'm excited to see what she does with that um, next year. And congratulations. And um, I'm really looking forward to working with you. I've known Jana for several years now. I've been at NCAR for about five years, and it seems like in the first or second year when Paul Welch had me come visit with the AIA California Council Board of Directors, Jana was present. She's present, obviously, because uh, you can't miss her. Uh, her striking smile, uh, her, her uh, focus really leaves a lasting impression, but I guess uh, what I really think about when I think of Jana is her smile. Uh, just like California, she's sunny, she's smart, and she's confident. And I think what a wonderful uh, accolade for this emerging generation for someone like her to represent that group and the entire California Council as their leader. She's been consistently thoughtful and wise in her interactions regarding um, how the Council can better understand and engage with NCARB and the path to licensure, and she's given me some great advice along the way. So my expectations for her as president, more of the same. And I wish you every good wish as you enter your year, and we expect to hear great things. Good luck. Hey, Jana, congratulations. I'm excited you're gonna lead AI California Council as president next year. It's always a pleasure working with you. You're smart, you're creative. Um, you always bring professionalism and positive energy to every table I've ever sat at with you. Um, and it's really contagious and it elevates what we're up, what we're doing. So I just really appreciate the past interactions we've had. As far as next year, um, I'm really excited to see you lead because as an architect and as a woman, um, as a mom, someone who's seeking balance, it's just really cool to me that you're filling this role. Um, I know there's a lot on the plate every year and with your skills as a connector and your great sense of humor, I just think it's going to be a great year. Hi Jana, this is Betsy and Brian Doggerby. Hi Jana. And we just want to congratulate you on coming in as the 2017 president of AIACC. We know that you're going to do great things next year because you've already done great things and uh, the council will be better for your being president uh, with your energy and your creativity uh, and we look forward to working with you to uh, to do great things and it's very exciting to pass the torch to you and we know your leadership experience in california will be amazing and that you'll have a lasting impact on the profession of architecture on our experience there's nothing like the california council so all the best to you we are we are here for you whatever you need take care bye jenna Hi, Jana. Hey, Jana. Congratulations on your installation as president. You know, I was thinking back to 2014 at that grassroots conference in DC. You definitely made a positive impact on my life uh, during that conference. I mean, we were marching down to NCARB on K Street, and we just walked right into Michael Armstrong's conference room, set up cameras and recording devices, and just really grilled them about what the future of uh, experience and uh, examination was going to be. And I knew at that point that I could follow this girl with a mohawk anywhere into the leadership realm. The presidency is just going to be so awesome with you. I mean, if you run the council's executive committee, anything like you've done Monterey Design, we're all going to have so much fun. 
You seem to balance uh, faith and family, uh, politics, practice, and fun in such a great way. We're all just going to be excited to follow you wherever you take us. So congratulations again and uh, look forward to working with you in the future. Biggest impact moment when we got married. Uh, because ever since then it's been about us figuring out the puzzle pieces and how in the world they go together. Um, next year as president, uh, it's going to be all about your broad view of architecture and how that brings architects uh, with various backgrounds, architects with various perspectives on architecture together so that we can move our profession forward in a positive direction. So thanks for going after it. I'm here to help. Jana, what an honor it's been to come alongside you the past 10 months. I am so excited about what 2017 is going to hold for you. Um, there's so many good changes and I feel honored to be a part of what's going on in your world. Your dedication and your loyalty to architecture, the community, your family, it truly inspires and encourages me every day. And I wish I could be there to celebrate with you, but cheers and have a great evening. Congratulations. Over the past four years, Jana has been a great role model for me, showing how to balance career, family, and volunteer projects with the AIA and do them all very well. I'm really looking forward to the way Jana is going to bring her energy and fresh ideas to the council as president. Hi everyone, I'm Nick Dokus and I was council president in 2010. I've gotten to know Jana over the past few years by working on AI committees at both the state and local levels. I'm really excited about her presidency this coming year because I know that her vision for our profession is to communicate the positive impact that we have on our communities, for our clients, and on our environment. So Jana, if you need any help whatsoever, just call. And thanks for the beef jerky. You know what I'm talking about. for a little more enthusiasm than that, but it's a rainy Friday morning here at your alma mater, Cal Poly San Luis Obispo, the northern one. And I just wanted to say congratulations. Um, I remember you in studio with your partner, and now your partner and partner. What I really remember, though, is you're coming back and giving time, hours of time, days of time, to my thesis students back in the early uh, mid-2000s. And so the, the six, seven hours that you would spend with people in Crits told me how committed you were to the next generation of students, not only as alums, but as architects. So as you go forward, my wish for you, Jana, is that you take forward the idea that architecture is about care. It's an intergenerational compact of us caring for the future. And so it's a beautiful building that shows care. We want it to be technically proficient, but it's our agreement with the future that we care about you too. So best wishes as you go forward with your investiture slash coronation slash presidency and have a great year, right? <laughs> <laughs>